uh, not necessarily gloomy, but there's a little bit of a haze to this morning, and that's because we do have some patchy fog out there, not necessarily impacting downtown, but there are folks across Northeast Ohio dealing with it a tad bit more than others today, much like yesterday. So a few scattered showers and storms in the picture, and then tomorrow more rain and rumbles. And beyond that, we've got a cool down ahead of us. So let's talk about temperatures first, because I mentioned cool down. And you're probably wondering when that arrives and how cool we actually get. Well, today and tomorrow close to 90 degrees, and then we see a front sweep on through a cold front may I add and that's going to drop our temperatures back into the upper 70s close to 80 degrees not only for your Tuesday Wednesday Thursday but into next weekend so if you didn't like this weekend when it came to getting out and doing any of your outdoor plans make them already for next weekend I give you the go ahead right now because the weather is looking mighty fine folks over the next few hours we will stay in the 70s then kind of stretch back into the 80s but today overall, 90 degrees is going to be our high. It is going to be another steamy day across Northeast Ohio. As I mentioned, a few storms, but I do want to tell you during the peak heat of today, the mid afternoon, late afternoon, early evening, our heat index values are going to feel warmer than what our air temperature is. And that is because the muggy feel is present. So yes, we're going to feel like the mid to upper 90s through the second half of today. Have a plan in place to beat the heat. When it comes to radar, everything is basically quiet as can be. Honestly, what's popping up over Portage right now, I wouldn't be too shocked if that is birds kind of all flying away or maybe some bug activity too. That is also what radar can go ahead and pick on. Up. But we have to look beyond just the Buckeye State right now. We have to look back off to the north and west. Chicagoland area is starting to get in on some of this rainfall. That's where that front sits. It'll make its way to us as we head through the next 48 hours altogether. Your National Zymert Hourbrier forecast highlights the fact that we could see a stray shower south of us during the first half of today. I think everything starts to kind of bubble on up as we head through the second half of today. And you're probably also wondering uh, if you're headed to the Guardians game, do you need to prep the rain gear? I would bring it. It's not going to be a complete washout. And I think the game will still be played, whether that is at the 12-10 start or a tad bit later, depending on if we get some pop-up activity in place for us. Union Home Mortgage extended forecast though near 90 not only today as I mentioned but also for the beginning of the work week and then we drop it. I told you you were going to like this forecast upper 70s and near 80 degrees for a stretch of more than two days folks. We get to enjoy this from Tuesday all the way on and may I add on top of this we get some refreshing air in place so humidity levels will take a back seat as we head into the later part of this upcoming work week. We just got to get through a few rain chances so keep the umbrella handy but also keep the sun glasses on tap because you will need them by the end of this week. Isabel. And welcome sunshine. I oh, like yes. it. Thanks Peyton.